this is one of the uh, most beautiful mummy that actually I discovered at Saqqara only about a few months ago. We went inside the burial chamber and we found this mummy completely by accident. The tomb is dated to the Old Kingdom about 4,200 years ago. But I never expected to discover inside the Old Kingdom tomb a typical late period mummy. It's very important to talk about mummification, to explain really what happened. When the deceased die, they take his body to wash. And after the washing, they began to open the stomach and they take all the viscera of the king, everything inside his stomach, they take it out. And they put it on natron to dry. And after that, they covered it with linen and they put it inside a box. After that, they leave the heart in the body because heart is the place of knowledge. It gives knowledge to the deceased in the afterlife. But they take the brain. Because if you leave the brain inside the mummy, the brain can be damaged. And that's why they go through the nose and they send some thin material inside and they take the brain out. After that, they take the body and they close everything open in the body of the deceased, like his uh, nose, like uh, areas inside hair. And after that, they completely clean and wash the body completely with uh, wine that made of dates. Then they put the wine that made of dates inside the body. Why they did all of that? Why the Egyptian mummified the body like this? Because they believed in the afterlife. They believed they have to preserve the body for a long time because this time inside the tomb is for eternal life. Egyptian did all of this because of the belief in the afterlife and that's why building a tomb, mummification, built ancient Egypt.